hello everyone welcome to my channel and welcome to today's video in today's video we are going to be making a facial serum this is an anti-aging facial serum that contain ingredients that's going to have to tighten and firm the skin this serum is an overnight serum and it's great to use right on top of your facial toner so if you're looking for a serum that you can apply to your skin at night and wake up with beautiful tight firm looking skin this serum is for you so continue watching now take a look at our main ingredient and this is flax seeds and flax seeds have antioxidant properties that is known to have to tighten and firm the skin flax seed have omega-3 fatty acid that will help to protect the skin from wrinkles and fine lines flax seed also help to boost the collagen production in the skin and help the skin to be fairer firmer and younger looking so what we're gonna be doing with our flax seed today to start with we are gonna be boiling the flax seed so you're gonna need a pot for this part of the recipe so here I have my sauce pot so I'm gonna use a quarter cup of the flax seed which is about a 60 ml we're gonna pour this in the pot and what we're gonna do next one cup of boiling water and then I'm gonna place this on the stove top to boil and I'm gonna boil this for about 10 minutes so you're gonna keep stirring until the peaks start to form once you start to see this whiteness coming on the top of it that is when it is ready so just stir a little longer and up close and take a look at this up close this is what it should look like all of that peak forming and now we're gonna remove it from the stove top now once we remove it from the stove top we're gonna set it aside for it to cool a little just get to warm and then we are gonna strain so you're gonna need a bowl a piece of cheesecloth or a strainer preferably a cheesecloth and we're gonna pour this in and as you can see how jelly it is make sure to get everything in all that gooiness is what we're going after we're gonna squeeze make sure to hold tight and we're gonna extract the gel and this is exactly how you want it squeezing up the gel and then get a few seeds out of mine but that's okay I will remove it after I'm just gonna remove the few extra seeds and I'm on the last one and take a look at this this is their pure flaxseed gel so now that we have our flaxseed gel ready we are going to pour this in the blender pour it in make sure to get out all the gel and we're going to move on now the first thing that we're gonna add to our flaxseed oil is some avocado oil now you can choose to use avocado oil or any of your favorite oil I'm using avocado oil because of its anti-aging properties that benefit the skin so I'm gonna use a half of a tablespoon of the avocado oil and I'm gonna pour this in and our next oil is coconut oil and I'm also using a half of a tablespoon of the coconut oil substitute any two carrier oil of your choice so we're pouring this in next I'm going to be using some aloe vera gel which will help to clear the skin of hyperpigmentation it also helps to nourish and moisturize the skin 
and I'm also using a half of a tablespoon of the hollow berry gel pouring this in I'm gonna be using some rose water in this and I'm using a half of a tablespoon of the rose water also if you do not have rose water you can leave it out one of the main oil that everyone need to use in this is some vitamin E oil and I'm using about a teaspoon my vitamin E is 28,000 IU use your discretion with the vitamin E I'm also going to use two of my favorite oil in this I'm using rose hip and I'm using papaya seed oil use oil of choice and I'm adding about a teaspoon of each and the next ingredient that I'm going to use in this is a skin lightening ingredient and this is turmeric powder now we're only going to be using a dash of the turmeric powder or a pinch and this is it that's enough just a little bit now here I have an optional ingredient and this is vegetable glycerine you can use it if you have it if you don't then that is okay moisturize the skin and I'm also using it as a preservative so I'm using about a teaspoon of the vegetable glycerine and we're gonna blend now after blending Now once you blend, what you're going to do, you're going to put this in the refrigerator for a few hours and then you're going to use it on your face. So cover and I'm going to place this in the refrigerator for about an hour or two and then I will be back. Now if you want to get the best result from this serum, you need to exfoliate your skin at least two to three times per week. After exfoliating, then use a facial toner and then you apply your serum. So I'm going to take a little bit of my serum and a little goes a long way and I'm just going to rub it in my hands like I'm showing here and then I'm just going to apply it to my skin. Now this serum is also good for the neck and decollete area. Now once I apply the serum to my skin, what I like to do, I like to massage my face a little bit. So you're just gonna massage the serum on your skin for about two to three minutes. And what you're gonna notice is that your skin is gonna start to feel very silky, very smooth, and that's exactly what you want. So you're gonna leave this serum on your skin, best leave it on overnight, and up on the rising in the morning, you are gonna rinse off so use this serum every night if you choose rinse off in the mornings and apply your favorite facial moisturizer amazing amazing skin tightening skin firming skin brightening overnight anti-aging facial serum so there you have it what are you waiting for go give this facial serum a try use it for a week or two and come back and leave your comment now if this is the first time watching you enjoy this video and you'd like to see more of these amazing videos then guess what look below you're gonna see the word subscribe just click on it and you will be subscribed also at the side of the word subscribe there's a little bell if you click on that you will get a notification as soon as I upload a video thank you all for watching and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye-bye.